In this video, I'm going to show you how you can fix the Bluetooth couldn't connect error here within Windows 11. Before we dive into this video, make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel with all notifications on. It really does help out the channel and lets us know that you want more content like this. But if your Bluetooth won't connect, here's how you can troubleshoot and fix it. The first thing that you're going to want to go ahead and do is actually open up your device manager. Right click the Windows icon here and there's going to be a device manager option. Go ahead and select it and it's going to open up a page that looks like this. What you're going to want to go ahead and do is actually expand the Bluetooth section right here and it's going to show you all of your Bluetooth devices. You're going to want to find your Bluetooth adapter. In my case, it's this one right here. Go ahead and select it and then right click it and hit enable device if it does say disable here. Obviously, if it says disable like it does for me, it does mean that it is currently enabled so you don't have to worry about it and we can move on to the next step. The next step is actually right clicking it again and what you're going to want to choose is actually this update driver option. What it'll do is automatically search for it if you select this one right here. Go ahead and click on that and see if you do need to update and install the latest driver. Now that should fix your issues if it's not connecting. If the Bluetooth icon over here doesn't appear, you might want to search your PC or laptop model online just to check to see if it does have built-in Bluetooth. If it does, obviously make sure you download the official Bluetooth drivers from the manufacturer's website and install them. If it doesn't have Bluetooth, you are going to need a USB Bluetooth adapter, which I'll try and link some in the description. Once you have your drivers installed and updated, or you have an adapter plugged in, your Bluetooth should now talk your Bluetooth should now be able to be toggled and will appear. Switch it on and you can start adding devices again. If you do have any questions, don't hesitate to ask us down in the comment section below. But before you leave this video, make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel. It really does help us out. Have a great day. Peace.